So this is a sim racing rig made up of 3 ASUS OLED gaming monitor with several advantages over the popular LG C2 OLED television. And after I raced around Silverstone on the simulator, they put me in a real Ferrari F330 and an Aston Martin Vantage to drive around the actual Silverstone track, just to demonstrate how close the OLED monitor's contrast and response times get to real life. The 42-inch ASUS PG42UQ OLED monitor is pitched directly against LG's 42-inch C2 OLED, offering at least 5 unique selling points over the C2. 1. The ASUS ROG Swift OLED monitor is equipped with a large custom heatsink, which together with carefully designed ventilation, serves to keep the OLED panel cool enough to reduce the risk of temporary image retention and permanent screen burn a benefit we have previously demonstrated on other OLED televisions equipped with heatsink compared to conventional OLEDs without heatsink. 2. The presence of this custom heatsink allowed ASUS to drive the OLED panel harder to achieve higher peak brightness. It is very likely that the ASUS PG42UQ will be brighter than the LG42 C2 whose peak brightness came in at 700 nits on a 10% window and 150 nits full fill. Remember, 42-inch and 48-inch OLED displays are generally dimmer than 55-inch and larger OLEDs due to lower pixel aperture ratio since the same number of pixels have to be packed into a smaller screen size. Because the ASUS PG42UQ is the only 42-inch OLED display I know of with a heatsink at the time I filmed this video in August 2022, I have high hopes that it will be the brightest 42-inch OLED on the market. It is something I will be measuring when I get my hands on a review sample, of course. Moving on to advantage number 3, the ASUS PG42UQ includes one DisplayPort 1.4 input which the LG42 C2 doesn't have, making the ASUS potentially more appealing to PC gamers. For console users, 4 HDMI ports are also available on the ASUS OLED monitor, of which 2 are HDMI 2.1 with 4K 120Hz ALM and display stream compression support. Advantage number 4 is that the DisplayPort 1.4 connection on the ASUS PG42UQ can be overclocked to reach 4K 138Hz refresh rate. Surpassing the 4K 130Hz cap on the LG C2's HDMI 2.1 ports, although to be fair, the difference between 4K 120Hz and 4K 138Hz is likely to be negligible in real-world usage. Advantage number 5 is that the ASUS PG42UQ behaves like a PC monitor, with automatic standby and wake up from a computer, unlike the LG C2 OLED where you have to manually turn the television on or off. To cater to owners using the ASUS PG42UQ without a PC, a remote control is also supplied in the box. Otherwise, the ASUS ROG Swift OLED Gaming Monitor ships pre-calibrated from factory with a detailed color checker report, promising delta errors of less than 2 out of the box. There is also an aspect ratio control function, allowing gamers to display 24-inch, 27-inch or 34-inch images without scaling. One design element that's slightly controversial is the implementation of matte anti-glare coating on the OLED screen. While this can suppress the intensity of direct reflections, it will also lower perceived contrast in the presence of ambient light compared to a glossy finish. Since the LG 48GQ900 Ultra Gear monitor which features a display port and 138Hz refresh rate also carries a similar matte finish, the anti-glare coating may have been built in by the OLED panel supplier. Now, the ASUS ROG Swift OLED monitor comes in two screen sizes, namely the 42-inch PG42UQ priced at £1400 and the larger 48-inch PG48UQ which is only slightly more expensive at £1500. Given the screen sizes, some of you may have correctly guessed that the screen on the ASUS PGUQ is a WRGB OLED panel supplied by LG Display. ASUS said they are using the latest generation OLED panels with greater efficiency and brightness, so it is likely to be a WBE panel, also colloquially known as an EVO panel. Besides true blacks, vibrant colors and wide viewing angles, one key reason why OLED displays have become such a hit among gamers is OLED's near instantaneous pixel response time. 
quoted at 0.1 milliseconds on the ASUS PG42UQ. To see for yourself the real-world differences of an OLED versus an LED LCD in terms of pixel response for gaming, go watch my side-by-side -side comparison video by clicking here.